it is always fun when we get raw materials. We can start making stuff. Good morning. Today, um, Trent is milking the cow with the girls. It's pretty adorable. Let's go see. Is the kitty right there? Bye, kitty. They fed you. You just didn't know. It's it's over by the door. You want to love the baby chick? Well, she's not a baby, but she's the size of a baby. Chicken. Wait, <laughs> Did she eat it? Yeah. <laughs> Emmy, are you gonna milk a cow? Yeah, let's see. <laughs> she got it that first time. <laughs> It's always nice when the rest of the family joins me in the barn while I'm milking. We couldn't afford a full load, so we got 10 tons of sand. It'll be enough to do a little bit of concrete. All right, better go pay the guy. So Alex never, what are we gonna do with this? I don't know. You don't know? You gonna play in it? I am. You are? The kids love it when we get sand. <laughs> they were so excited when we when I said that we were having the sand delivered. Well we've been getting all kinds of deliveries lately. This one though happens to be free. A truck from a tree trimming company just showed up. Mm, it smells fantastic. Wow. <laughs> that is just awesome. So that's at least $100 worth of stuff if we were to buy it. So awesome. <laughs> smells like Christmas. It does smell like Christmas. <laughs> because it has Christmas It leaves. feels like Christmas. Yeah. I smell some because there's wood. Okay, so this is the mulch that they dubbed off 
for free last year. Um, this was a bunch of cottonwoods and stuff that they had chopped up. And then if you dig, the chickens have been scratching through here, so they've been, you know, spreading it around. But look at that. It's all black and slimy in there. I mean, that's decomposing all into tiny bits. When they dropped it off, it wasn't this small. I mean, it was chunks. Mm, it smells like dirt. It was big chunks like that. And then underneath, it's... Look at that. It's all broken up and black. So that's what's going to happen to our new pile. <laughs> Not sure exactly where to put it yet, but I think wherever we put it, it's going to be beneficial. It'll keep the moisture in there and protect the uh, microbiological things, <laughs> the microbes <laughs> that are uh, under the soil, you know, helping the plants. And generally, uh, mulch is a, is a good idea. If we were ever going to have chickens in a stationary coop, I would fill their coop with like this much mulch because they love it. And then I'd just keep giving them more and more and it would just end up being the coolest compost pile combined with chicken manure. Yep, and that would break down with all their high nitrogen manure. And What do you have, Banch? A worm. A worm? And you have one too, Emmy? Mm. Did yours fall? Oh no, it's right there. Cute. We found these worms in this mulch. <laughs> these worms weren't necessarily in the bark, they were under the bark, in the in the road base. So if bark can help you know bring life into road base, then it can do wonders for actual dirt. And it does. Here are two other piles of material. Here I have some black compost. Really nice stuff actually. And this here is just a uh, kind of subsoil, kind of sandy soil. Okay, here in front of me now, behind the shed, is the raised bed. We're really excited about this. Look what we've done. We didn't um, didn't mortar these bricks in, but we're gonna go a couple more layers up. And uh, yeah, anyway, it's just pretty. I can see the potential for this area. Got a ways to go still. Hey, Buttercup. Look how big my pond is already. Yeah, just kidding. I wish. It'll eventually get there though. But honestly, I like oops, I like imagining things like that. That these little trees that are planted in this tiny little pond that I've started are huge and where we want them to be. And it's the vision that keeps us going. If we can't really see or imagine something grand and amazing, then it's very difficult to to accept that that could be real. But as soon as you accept the reality of it in your future, it's pretty easy to obtain. It just takes time. Thanks for watching. I'll see you tomorrow. Look at this. So excited that they didn't forget about us. I told them last year to bring as much as they possibly can, and then they kind of stopped for a few months. And uh, we're glad that they uh, brought this. We can definitely put it to use. All that chipped wood makes incredible mulch. <laughs>